hello, hello, and welcome to Games Revisited. We're back, and it's episode 33, so we're going to continue our playthrough of Chrono Trigger. Uh, last week ended up a little bit short. I was feeling a little under the weather. I only got two episodes recorded on the live stream on Thursday. And while I'd kind of hoped to be able to record the other four over the weekend, um, I spent a lot of time uh, resting. <laughs> So, we're, we're getting ready to get back in the saddle. One of the things that I did get done while I was homesick is I did a little bit of grinding because I needed something that I could do while, um, that I could easily set down again if needed. So, Chrono's uh, fully decked out on his tech tree all the way up to Luminaire. Um... That, that is the uh, nuclear option of lightning magic, not the candlestick who would like you to be his guest. Um, frogs all the way up to Frog Squash. Luca's all the way up to Flare. Marley's got Arise. And Robo has Electrocute. You'll notice Ayla's missing because I haven't picked her up in the party yet. In order to do that, I was going to have to trigger some story elements, and I wanted to make sure I got all those on camera. So I will eventually circle back around and get her leveled up as well. So don't don't think that I forgot about her. Uh, I just didn't get a chance to do it. Now, hopefully, um, somewhere around level 38 or so, I'll be in a position to get back to the end of time to go fight Specchio, because we're almost at the end of what uh, of the, his different forms. Because remember, uh, if you get there levels one through nine, he's one form, and then you get some special stuff, and then ten through nineteen. He's another one. You get some special stuff. Um, 30 through 39 is going to be another one where he'll give us a magic tab and a power tab um, and some other stuff that I don't recall because I, I'm live now. And, of course, my, the memory would flee. Uh, <laughs> and uh, the the one after this, though, is going to be the interesting one. Because he's going to hold on to the next form from level 40 through level 98. And, and so you'll only get the stuff when you beat him once in that form. And then at level 99, he will take on his ultimate form, which is like the second hardest battle in the entirety of the game. So uh, there that is. But he gives you 10... Uh, 10 of three different types of tabs, if I remember right, along with some other goodies. So um, if you do the new game plus, you, you can get some really nice stuff going that way. All right, enough yakking. If you remember story-wise, we went and fought Magus, we defeated him, and we found out that he didn't... Um, he didn't create Lavos, he merely summoned him. And so Lavos got summoned, something went wrong, we got sent back here where they're mad at us about that Ioka village off on our left. You, you can tell by the way I'm leaning in the wrong way. Um, <laughs> over here, uh, the Ioka village, or the Laruba village got uh, ravaged, and now everybody's pissed off. So we're going to go meet up with Ayla at the Dactyl Nest. And um, and then go go get us some new leather belts. <laughs> well, that's not ominous. All right, you know what? Uh, we could avoid the fights, but where's the fun in that? I want to show off some of the stuff. So, what does this luminaire do? It does this. Bam. Oh, he actually lived through it. Huh. Oh. He was only mostly dead. He wasn't all dead. All right. Ooh, and we'll want to catch that box later. Kind of hate that all my maps are in the Nintendo Power Guide and I'm out of desk, so I can't exactly uh, go check it. I'm going to try to save my magic points while I'm at it, too. These guys shouldn't be that hard to beat without it. Except she doesn't shoot that hard. 
Oh, well. Alright, some XP. And what do you have? A mid -ether. And... Potion. Alright, fine. Give me your XP. Okay, I know you all will die with this. So let's just uh, unleash the nuke. And get this show on the road. Um, well, he's blocking the way up, so we don't have much of a choice. Well, I haven't done any of his stuff, so let's go ahead and show you the Frog Squash. Frog's ultimate. And if that doesn't do it, we'll drop a flare. Yes, a psychedelic frog drops from above. <laughs> And steps on everything. <laughs> it's glorious. It's glorious. I was kind of expecting everybody to die on that one. Hmm. This is not going as planned. Alright, maybe if I stopped joking around and actually paid attention to what I was doing. Alright, fangs, petals, and things, and let's go ahead and... Yeah, that's got everybody close enough. Well, for, you know, government definitions of close enough. Oh wait, they were that way before. Alright... Onward, forward, and let's dodge this fight. Ooh, a Mesomail. I'm not going to change the armor. If you remember last week, I was doing a little bit of armor shopping, and I opted not to, um, well, except for the dark mail. <laughs> Everybody else has a ruby vest, and the reason why they do is because it has fire damage. And I know that the big boss that we're getting ready to head to likes to lean on that fire damage so I'm okay taking a moderate hit and um, here let's do lightning too that cost less there we go okay um, yeah so while we're taking a slight hit on the defense the fact that it's going to seriously block a large chunk of the damage that we're going to receive uh, makes it worth it. Hello, Ayla. I almost want to start singing Layla, but I know that's not right either. Chrono! You aren't trying to sneak off without us, are you? No, Tyranno Lair, danger. You know come. Maybe I'll die. Nah. Well, I mean, all of them will die, but okay. Uh, <laughs> nope, we can't turn our backs on you like that. We owe you one. I guess. Right, Chrono? Ayla have good friend. Which one's getting left behind? Is this where we make the decision, or... Yep, there we go. Okay. I'm going to take Frog with me. Hmm. Frog, Robo, or Marley. Uh, Frog's got some decent healing, but better offensive magic. On the other hand, he's already burned through a few magic points. Not that I haven't already. Um, hmm. Ooh. Yeah, let's go ahead and leave Frog in there for now. Not like we can't change it out later if we need to. If it doesn't look like it's, you know, not working out that well. Oh, 
Uh, here's one of the cute videos the remake added. Probably when they did it for the uh, Nintendo DS. Because this sure wasn't in the original NES. I'm happy I finally got the video stuff to show up right on stream. Pickle me, pickle me, pickle me too. Oh wait, no, that's not a flying shoe. Alright, so now we're free to pretty much fly around the area. Not too much we can do with that ability just yet. Although, huh. There's an island over here. What's in the sunshine? Oh, nothing yet. I guess we'll find out later. I honestly didn't expect it to let us land. Um, yeah, so you you can fly pretty much anywhere you want, except other than the Tyranno Lair. There's nowhere else to really go in the prehistoric era just yet. Um, we will be making our way back later. All right, let me just double check. Yeah. Yep. Okay. So we just flew around the world and we ended up back. So let's drop off here. And I'm going to go ahead and use a shelter. Even though I know I wasn't that far behind, but just because. And we'll do a quick save. Uh, were I so inclined, I'd probably go back and start grinding up A-list tech just to catch her up to the rest of the party, because she is a fair bit behind. Um, but honestly, I'll, I'll do that at the next break between episodes, uh, or between live streams at least. Alright, let's do this. Let's knock these guys out. Uh, let's hit them all with water too. Some lightning too. Hmm. I never did find out what uh, you could charm off of these guys. We might find out. If they don't stop throwing each other at us. Uh, I noticed they're concentrating on poor old frog here. That can't be good. And we got... Oh, a fang. Okay, never mind. That was a waste of a charm. <sighs> okay. Let's just hit him with the regular attacks. They should fall pretty quick. There we go. Some XP, some tech points, some mid potion. Although the only one who ne really needs tech points right now is Ayla. There we go. We got some... Uh, Dual techs learned. Might want to just rotate the party around for that sheer fact alone. All right. And let's hit these guys with lightning because they are weak to it. All the reptites are. Bam. And bam. There we go. Alright. A whopping eight tech points. Speaking of, before I forget, let's go ahead and top everyone's health back off. Yeah, that's close enough for now. I don't want to turn through too many magic points just yet. Free the villagers. Come on, you guys are supposed to paint your face blue and shout freedom. Don't you know? Alright, let's repeat our uh, zap everybody. And then attack. There's probably something I should be charming off of these guys, but honestly, I'm not, I'm not too fussed about it right now. 
Okay. Some XP, some tech points, some mid potion. Nice. Well, we get to do this again. <laughs> We're about to have a feast, and you're about to be the roast beast. <laughs> nah. It's the apes. I am not an animal. I am... No, oh, sorry. Go watch the old Charlton... Charlton Heston, Planet of the Apes. The good one. That actually was a really good movie, and it was really well done. The remake, uh... Eh, was okay. All right, some XP's and tech points, and Ayla's levels up. Now she's got Tailspin. Uh, what is the next tech on her list? It is... there we go. That should give me an area attack with her finally, because Boulder Toss is just a one person, one person, one person heal. That should hit... oh, okay, good. It's all foes. Damage higher when hit points is low. Good to know. Although that's going to be a little ways away. Come on, let him out. The button's right there. There's a button right there. How about you push the button? Or climb awkwardly? Hmm. Kino, sorry. All Kino's fault. It's okay. Kino take all Aruba person. Run. What Ayla do? Strong live, weak die. Go be strong. Alright, come on guys. Uh, yeah. <laughs> there's, a, there's a button right there. Do we really need all the dramatics? Alright. Alright, we'll take care of that in a minute. First, we get a mid ether out of the egg in the back. And I'm willing to bet he is going to open the door that was closed just a minute ago. Aw, oh, it's almost like you're being railroaded. <laughs> Seriously? You're strong. Kino weak. Yeah. I could do a fair fight. Or I could do that. Alright. Uh, hmm. Uh, we'll do the lightning too. Oh, that's only around her. Okay. Alright, I guess we'll just ditch out the regular attacks after that. Bam! Onward and forward, right? Come on, guys. Why you gotta do this to me? I'm not wasting magic on you. Not for one guy. Okay. That was interesting. Uh, oh, that's right. This has all the weird teleports and stuff. Um, ooh. She's going to want to charm out of him. He's going to want to go ahead and do that. And he's going to want to do... A regular attack on that guy. <laughs> yeah, I forgot he did that. Bam. Done. Um. Oh, 
Okay. I totally missed if she successfully charmed him. And this is why we have the uh <laughs> only take half the fire damage. The Ruby Mail. Alright, I need to go lightning this dude again. Not focused. Not focused. It's just the one guy. Lightening him up. Gone. Done. Yay! Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and hit up that heal again. Chrono's a little low. We'll do that. That'll keep him close enough for now. Um... There's the helmet. Actually, is that something I want to put on right now? Uh, so the stone helmet is defense 20. The triceratopper is 23. Yeah. We'll do that right now. I know there's a way to get there. Was... Where was it? Nope. Okay, um... Let's get rid of that guy. Let's do... That. And we'll see if we can't finish off some fools. Bam! Alright, that took care of things pretty quick. I know there's a teleport that'll take me over there. I just don't remember where it is. Um... There we go. Now, well, I'm thinking about it. So that's magic defense plus five and a defense of 45. Mm. That is a lot of defense. But that means my magic defense drops. Yeah, no. Nah, I'm gonna hold off. I'll wait till I get done with all these fire breathing fools. And then uh and then we'll go ahead and go from there. Oop. Here we go again. Alright, let's get him going. Bam. Alright, and actually, while I'm thinking about it, let me go ahead and... No, not party. Let me go... Equipment. Robo. I'm actually going to take the Rage Band off of Robo. Um... Speed plus two. Accuracy, strength. 
His strength is already pretty high. I'm not going to worry about that. Um, either the magic or... Or the speed belt. Yeah, let's give him the speed belt. And then we can go here and move her from the power scarf to the rage band. Where did it go? There we go. Because uh, I'm going to have to have her anyway, and getting in those extra attacks might be uh, beneficial. Come on, guys. Alright, let's uh, help them ride the lightning. <laughs> you can sing the Metallica song if you want. Gone. Alright. Seriously, people, why are you doing this to me? I need those guys gone first. So if I remember right, the lightning is going to heal them. There we go. Now we can knock these guys out. Throw a little static. Finish them off. Ah. Oop. That wasn't what I wanted to hit. I'll try to finish this guy off quick. There we go. Got to keep an eye on those magic points, too. Ooh, and the health. All right. But before I do that, I get to leave you in suspense because uh, <laughs> we're a little bit over the time I allotted for this episode. So... I'm going to slide on over the credits and thank you for joining along so far. If you're watching live on Twitch or Mixer, hang tight. There's still more to come. If you want to watch live, I stream on Thursdays at 6 p.m. U.S. Eastern. There's a link in the description below. If you haven't already, follow in Twitch or Mixer to get notified when I go live. And definitely, definitely subscribe to the YouTube channel. It helps the channel out and you get notified when new episodes and other content get posted. So, live folks, give me a minute to prep the next episode. YouTube folks, I will see you tomorrow. <laughs>